Alrighty, guys, I apologize in uh, advance. I am currently sick. I have somewhat of a cold, so I apologize if my voice is a little bit raspy and messed up. But there is a lot more we need to talk about about this Damian Lillard situation. Number one being, where do we think Drew Holiday is going to go? Now, out the gate, we have teams like the Lakers, the Clippers, the Heat, the Bulls, the Celtics, the Sixers, all interested in, in uh, Drew Holiday out the gate. And I was watching First Take this morning, and uh, Brian Woodard has brought up the New York Knicks th saying, if you bring in Drew Holiday, you are you are seriously a big threat in the Eastern Conference. And I think anybody who acquires Drew Holiday takes a significant leap in the NBA standings. People don't realize how important Drew Holiday was to that championship run the Bucks had. I mean, talk about a true veteran. Talk about a two-way, an actual two-way player, a, a gold medalist, a champion. Just a, just a true veteran who in big moments is going to show up and who can be just a true defensive stopper for you in the playoffs and or just during the regular season. As much as I love all these teams, and I mean, yeah, there is a lot of good, good options here for Drew Holiday to go to, I have a team that I think, one, would just significantly leap them to a top tier in, in the conference, as well as the Portland Trailblazers can get a big load back. Why don't we have a reunion for Drew Holiday? Why don't we bring him back to New Orleans? The biggest thing that I saw last year for the Pelicans that they were lacking is that they could not stop a lick on defense. Outside of Jonas Valanciunas, there was not a really good defender. Brandon Ingram tries defensively, but he's just that's just not his game. He is an offensive player. Also, you look at that roster last year. Who is a veteran on that team? Brandon Ingram is your veteran. Jonas Valanciunas, they both lack playoff success as well as deep playoff runs. You bring in Drew Holiday, a true actual veteran, somebody who can be your number one defender on any team that you are playing. I think this could significantly jump the New Orleans Pelicans. One, if Zion Williamson is healthy, and two, if they actually pull the trigger. I think you start Drew Holiday in the backcourt with CJ McCollum, put him back at the number two, make Drew Holiday be the true point guard. I think you're in some serious business in the Western Conference, who in my opinion is up for grabs outside of the Denver Nuggets. And the Portland Trailblazers can get a haul back. I mean, you look at this lineup they have. Jose Alvarado, Dyson Daniels, Willie, Willie Herman Gomez, Herbert Jones, uh, EJ Liddell, Najee Marshall, Trey Murphy III, Larry Nance Jr. I mean, you could even throw in Jonas Valanciunas. I know they just got DeAndre Ayn, so probably Jonas wouldn't make sense. But there is a haul of young talent on this team that you can get back for Drew Holiday as well as some picks. So in my opinion, if we want to do another trade that makes sense for both sides of the field, it's the New Orleans Pelicans. One, I think Drew Holiday makes them a top four seed in the Western Conference, and Portland gets a haul back and really significantly jumps their rebuilding process. Let me know down below who you all think uh, Drew Holiday, should, or where he should go. I mean, there's other teams that I really like. I do like the Heat. I like the Bulls a lot, actually, too. I think Drew does a lot of what Lonzo did. Yes, he's not the passer that Lonzo is, but I think defensively and him being a pretty solid three-point shooter, he could really help that Bulls team get back to playoff contention. Obviously, being a Clippers fan, I would love him to go to the Clippers, but I just the, the, the I don't know what the Clippers really would offer. Boston's probably the most ideal spot. I just don't know exactly what Boston would want to give up, but you basically substitute Marcus Smart in for Drew Holiday. That's a huge upgrade. As well as you brought in Porzingis, that would make them them right there with the Milwaukee Bucks as the best team in the Eastern Conference. But yeah, just let me know where y'all think Drew Holiday should end up. What teams do you think? I personally just think New Orleans Pelicans is the best fit for both sides. Portland can get a haul back as well as New Orleans really takes a leap in the Western Conference.